my best friend, Monty's mom, and my little burrito. We finally made it to our wedding day. What seems like a whirlwind of a year has finally led us to this point right now, and what a journey it has been. I still can't believe you, you packed up your entire life in your little Civic and moved all the way out to snowy, dreary Buffalo. Mm -hmm. That sacrifice and commitment to us made this entire journey possible. To my future husband, 13 years ago, I spotted you from across the room. There was something I felt seeing you for the first time and every time after that that I could never explain. For years, I searched for what that feeling was, trying to understand how I felt so pulled to someone I didn't know. Until a few months ago, I stumbled upon this Japanese phrase that spoke so true to the way I had always felt in those early years. Koi no yoken. I vow to always show up for you to be your greatest supporter and biggest cheerleader. I promise your life, your accomplishments, and your journey will not go unnoticed because I will be there to notice it. I will stand with you and by you forever. <laughs> <laughs> I vow to always be honest with you, to honor you in our marriage each day that I wake. And when death does choose to take my hand, I will hold you with the other and promise to find you in every lifetime. I am so lucky that you have chosen me, Zachary and I will love you forever and ever. Amen. My promise is to you. I vow to put you first. You have made a tremendous sacrifice for us, and I can't say enough how much I love you for that. Now that we have settled in KC, it's time for us to focus on our future family. I vow to listen not only to your words, but to your body, mind, and spirit. Not only when you ask for help, but when you need help. I vow to put aside my pride and my stubbornness and listen. I've learned, that le I've learned these lessons over the past few months, and once I listen, I can finally understand and become your support. And then most of all, I vow to love you unconditionally. You are my heart, my soul, my everything. I love you, Luke Renee. Kiss your Now finding a beautiful, lovely, kind, and sweet girl to be your wife is just amazing. And I can't wait to see what happens next. Uh, you guys are the greatest. I love you. things I just said, a good friend, somebody there for you, um, amongst many other things are why my husband and I chose to name my daughter after her. Because Nellie Logan Thompson, I would love for you to take any kind of character trait or any being of my sister, because I think she's that good of a person. Oh.